Hello, Vicky. Uh, the recent comment you left, uh, I made a short video here for you. The thing that struck me most was that you said you might want to try a small tree. And you were, it would be your first one. Uh, for your first tree, I suggest using soft copper. Uh, this little itty bitty tree here, I was on a long car ride and uh, I decided to, you know, have something I could work on in a car. So it's really little and the, I got this wire out of a old electrical cord. Um, the new ones have really, really thin wire. I don't know how big this stuff is. It's sub millimeter in diameter, but it doesn't really matter exact size. And you don't need a jig. This tree here was uh, all made um, just with my hand, except for the leaves. You need a tool to do that. So for your first tree, just have fun with it. Don't just twist it up with your fingers. This soft copper, it's real easy to twist. And it looks good when you twist it up. But uh, as far as the making of the leaves go, you can see these are some really, really little loops. But uh, here's how one does this. Oh, oh, oh. you go to your jeweler and you show them this video and that right there is made from brass and that's what I make all these little leaves with it's really small and the other thing that's nice too and jewelers can do this but you could just have them make it really small it unscrews And that's how you twist up your leaves with this little guy. It's nice to have it something that can make it a little longer because when it's a little longer, it's easier to make the leaves in my opinion. But uh, you need it short sometimes too because you get in tight spaces in there in the tree. And uh, yeah, that's that's how I do it. I don't think I could even get this to grab a wire on camp. Well, let's see. Oh yeah, I can. Uh, it's hard to do on camera. Okay, it's not as easy as I thought. But um, yeah, seriously, Vicky, don't don't overthink it for your for your uh, your little trees because uh, you want to just have fun and you know and if, odds are your first tree is not gonna come out exactly the way you want it. It takes a little little bit of practice, but uh, yeah, start small. Find an old electrical cord and a wire cutters and then maybe go to the jeweler and have them. Or maybe you know a guy who's good with metal. I mean, you don't have to be a genius to uh, get something like this out of brass. It's not that tough. It's just uh, finding the thing to make a, the slot cut. And like on this one, you can even see... There was no way I could cut a slot that was as thin as this wire because you can't find a saw blade that's that thin. So I cut the slot a little bigger and then I just kind of pounded them together a little bit to get the final gap in there. So Vicky, um, yeah, or anybody else who's just sees my channel and says, hey, I want to start doing this. Those big trees I make out of that aluminum wire, they're really dangerous. I mean, even this stuff could poke your eye out, you know, if you slip and the thing falls towards your face. But uh, that 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 aluminum I use for those bigger trees, that stuff's really stiff and it's going to try really hard to poke your eye out. So you got to be really careful. And it'll put holes in other parts of your body too. You got to watch, you know, it'll even try and sneak up your ear and poke out your eardrum if you're not careful. So, Vicky. I hope this answers your question and I hope you have fun with your first tree.